Hi guys and welcome to QM Games. This week has been fantastic with the release of Palworld and Enshrouded. Both the games are similar in so many aspects and yet so different. If you are a fan of Enshrouded but you have been failing to launch the game due to no compatible graphics driver error or graphics driver not up to it error then this fixes are for you. The first fix we suggest is to download the latest GPU driver and up update your current GPU driver with it. So let me show you how to do it. There are three ways you can do it. You can do it from device manager or you can directly go to the GeForce web website and download the update or you can do it through GeForce experience. I suggest that you do it either through GeForce experience or directly from the website. For the website, I'll drop the link in the description and let me show you how to do it through GeForce experience. Open GeForce experience. go to drivers and simply click on check for drivers I have the latest driver so it's not displaying but there was a driver release yesterday and if you have not downloaded the latest driver you'll get that driver over here download the driver and install it while installing choose custom install and perform a clean install of the drivers it will require for you your system to restart but that's the best way to update your driver okay so once you have done this fix then check if your game launches or not if it does not then we have a few other fixes that you can try for for laptop users or users of PC also who have two GPUs this fix is for you this fix is for those people who have two GPUs so Go to your device manager, press Windows plus X, then choose device manager. Go to a, go to the device manager, then under dis adapters, display adapters, click on it. Then you should be able to see two display adapters. I have only one GPU, so you can you, you can see only one. So the one in integrated graphic driver means the one that is less powerful that comes with your mm, this processor. So if you have Intel, then there will be an Intel and there will be an NVIDIA. So right click on the Intel one and choose disable device. That's all you need to do and your game should run. If it still doesn't run, then and this fix is for <coughs> AMD users. If uh, your game still doesn't work, go to Windows search bar and type advanced system settings advanced system settings sorry when you see view advanced system settings click on it go to environment variables in environment variables click on new then paste this value I'll write this value in the video description paste this in variable name and variable value should be 1 click ok and ok again that's all you need to do and your game should work if the game still doesn't work then install the Vulkan drivers for your GPU I'll again I'll drop a link in the description you can go to this page and according to your graphics card you can download the Vulkan drivers and install them once you install them then your game should work because because this game it uh, runs on Vulkan so you need to install the Vulkan drivers then the next fix is again for AMD Radeon users you need to enable GPU scaling to do this go to AMD Radeon settings then open AMD Radeon, then navigate to display settings, then enable GPU scaling. Go and enabling, uh, enable GPU scaling and save the changes. If none of the ever fixes have worked for you, then the best thing you can do is uninstall the GPU driver completely and download and install a fresh copy of it. Try to do all the six fixes and hopefully the game works for you. I'll also drop a link in the video of our website where we have written all the steps clearly you can follow either from our website or this video thank you for watching and i hope you like the video if you like please give a like and subscribe thank you